Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video is I'm going to be giving a review on this one right here, Wake Up and Make Up Magnetic Lashes by Belle Chloe. <laughs> So I'm expecting that I will have difficulty um, attaching this falsies or magnetic falsies right here. So first things first is what I received. So this is what I received from Wake Up and Make Up or Belle Chloe. And it's a cute small black black box. And this is the product right here. It is well presented. It has a cover like a gift wrapper cover and then hold on so here's the product and what you get inside this box right here is this um falsies the magnet falsies so you've got the actual product right there and you've got the small um hairs or lashes and let's see and also they've included a um, tweezer is this a tweezer like a flat one I love using this one I love using a flat like this kind of tweezer when it comes to putting on my um, falsies so this one right here and we shall see if this is this is metal so we'll see how the lashes magnetic lashes react to this metal oops so it grabbed a piece of magnet that's it so i don't know um i'm really doubtful that i would be able to attach or wear the lashes easily but let's get it on okay so first thing i'm gonna wear the falsies or magnetic falsies first so you will see um right away if it's really um, easy to attach or not or easy to wear and then after that i'm gonna tell you my opinions regarding the product so first is I'm gonna grab the the falsies right there hold on so I'm having difficulty positioning the okay right there and then what I am going to do is to stop talking and just try to wear the <laughs> magnetic lashes i feel like i don't right off the bat i feel like i don't like using this um wide tweezer right here because it's messing up it's i hope you could see clearly see what the oh my god damn hold on what should I do when you don't have a mirror? Okay, so I think I'm gonna do it like that. First, and uh, I'm gonna grab. <laughs> oh my god, I'm so sorry, Belle Chloe. If. <sighs> so, this is the common thing about, um, about this. Um, magnetic lashes people are really having a hard time attaching it but once your ba uh, band is like curved then I think that will be easier but right now it's just super plain straight and uh, I don't know how to start this one perfectly okay there you go I got it there you go so Edge is attached. I think you, I'm just gonna use three magnetics, small hair magnets, because they only gave like three on the other side and three on the left or right side. Okay, there you go. And So I think I've seen people were complaining about this side right here because the band is sticking out. So let me fix that. I see. And then press. 
So that's how the magnetic their magnetic lashes looks like and it's pretty um durable like if you do it like that it's pretty like stable that's what i'm trying to say it's pretty stable i thought it would be difficult to attach or to um, apply it or wear it but i am seeing a technique don't follow where your band is or where your band is pointing you should go straight under your real lashes and then the band will just magnet to where your small magnets are i don't know if that makes any sense but um that's how that um the lashes there looks like and i could see that it's it's not 100 percent sticking like next to my skin it's like i don't know it's weird it's not perfect and I would say at first you would really have a hard time perfecting it but the longer you use probably three times use, using the lashes or the magnetic lashes probably the it will be more easier. So we'll test it if this one works with sunglasses. Okay, so I would say um, in their website they have four designs or four styles. The first one is natural, the second one is sporty, and the third one is double denim wispies, and the last one is their dramatic. So I would say I believe that the dramatic is their very vava boom or the longest one, which is what I am wearing right now. But so you will have a good idea how this one looks like or is it really a baba boom kind of style? I have one right here that I sometimes wear. This is literally like extra baba boom. And let's have a comparison between the two. So as you can see, there is a very huge difference between the two. This is dramatic, as what Tate said, and this is also dramatic, um, but in a different brand. So as you can see, oh, what the hell? What are you doing, Yanasu? So, um, you would really see a huge difference between the two. So, what's good about this one right here, even if it's not as bababoom as the one we used to compare? Um, you could wear this in a daytime, not just nighttime. So, that's the difference between the two. Because the other one, I would say, um, if you're too bold enough to wear it in the daytime, then go on. But... Um, that one is really appropriate for a nighttime event. So uh, um, let's proceed. Um, I've said earlier that we're gonna test it with the sunglasses, wearing sunglasses and falsies because I have noticed that um, some of my falsies doesn't work with sunglasses. They're they're not that on, very compatible because why? As myself, I don't have a very long pointy tip and a long bridge or what you, how do you say that like american bridge but that's why I, sometimes i really have a hard time so if you're wearing that kind of baba boom lashes what happened it, it'll press hard onto your sunglasses and you will have a hard time blinking so that's why i'm gonna test it if this one does that so so far uh, I, so far not so far but i would say that i could blink normally compared to some of the vava boom eyelashes that i used and yeah they are and i would say even though um some of the like the hair touches the this one right here i would say it's pretty secure the magnetic lashes is pretty secure compared to the glue ones so that's it so the this one works well with the sunglasses. So you could wear sunglasses or reading glasses. What else? So how does it feel? So I would say that because right now um, I'm feeling weird because it's not attached properly. But like I've said earlier, if you'll just practice putting it on, it will be very easy and um, you'll achieve perfection because right now I could see the gaps between my skin and and as well as the lash band so it's not 100% 100, 100 perfectly um, attached but 
I think it looks nice hand cam. Anyways, is it really heavy on the eyes? No, I would say I could wear this for eight hours or more than that. It's not. I could feel that there is something in there or on there, but it's manageable. That's it. And how about the price? So the price is really good. It's affordable. I think they only sell it for like 20 plus. And if you're doubtful, you could yeah check their website and what else so the only thing that i am really having difficulty is um practicing or attaching it or wearing it that's it because the band is really stiff because it's new so that's it but i will keep using this for like three days four days five days because i'm working soon so we'll see and i would say it's this is really reliable <laughs> like see i'm pulling it but it's still sticking right in there so final thought i would say that this is worth the purchase you could try it yourself and if you just mastered um attaching this on your eyes then it will be very convenient especially if you're a kind of person that is working very early and you are always in a rush so yeah this is the easiest way than putting glue on your uh, falsies and waiting for it to dry so that's it guys hope everything does make sense and if it's if and if it's not clear then please do let me know by leaving your comment or question down below and i'm gonna answer all of your questions and yeah if you want to visit their website as well like i've said earlier go check my description box it will be posted in there and if you're planning to um purchase one of the magnetic lashes then you could use my discount code so you will have a discount so that's it guys thanks for watching and please don't forget to click the like button and if you're not subscribed then please do subscribe see you on my next post i love you bye